this is Linda from homeschoolingsix.com and today I wanted to share with you something from Dyslexia Games. I'm really excited about this um, series. It's Word Hunt. There's Word Hunt 1, Word Hunt 2, and Word Hunt 3. And this is to help your children learn to spell. Um, Sarah Janice Brown created these. This is part of Dyslexia Games. And this is a really neat way for your children to learn to spell because they are looking for words. They're interacting with all these words. They're finding them. They're counting the letters to see if they will fit in um, the day. Like if one day says find four letter words. So they're, they're searching and they're also looking at other words while they are searching for the four letter word. And I just imagine their brains just all these little neurons moving around. Um, you know, lighting up and such. Um, so it's just, it just makes new connections. It strengthens the pathways. It's just such a different way to learn how to, how to spell. So this is um, Word Hunt 1, and the Dyslexia Game Series A is for children 5 to 8. And right here it says, find six, 16 three-letter words. So they'll go hunting around the house, in their books, in cookbooks, you can use the Bible. Um, they can look at cereal boxes and so forth and just get up and wiggle and not, you know, if they really need to just get up between subjects, they could go and look for their words. And this one is find, this one is also find 16 four-letter words. And this one goes to five-letter words. And let's see what the last page um, it looks like this one goes up to five letter words. So again, this is for ages five to eight. Word Hunt 2 is from Dyslexia Series B. This is book four if you were to have the whole series and is for ages eight to 12. And again, it says find 23 letter words. 20, that's separated, 23 letter words. And then right here is find six. And this is the physical book. And if you notice on this side, it doesn't have anything. So you could also use that page to get creative with your children. Have them write their words that they found, again, using gel pens or colored pencils, crayons, markers. You know, those are always colorful and fun. So that's just another way to get them writing those words again. So right here, this one says, find 10 eight-letter words. So this one says eight. Let's see how far up this goes to. I think that's the highest. Um, find 10 eight letter words. Yep. So that one goes up to eight letters. And at the end of this one, uh, there's a few logic games. And some of the pages also have the logic games. Word Hunt 3. This is from Series C and is for ages 10 and up. And this one I printed. It's a download. Um, so I just you know, stapled it right here. This one looks a little different inside. I really like this one. Right here it says find 20 words that have five letters. So as you can see, they're going to be writing in these little, to me they look like little rocks, but um, they'll be writing in that. And then also down here. And here's another page. It looks different. And your child can color the pages if they like. Throughout this book, it's also, it says, it's time to do whatever you want with this page. So there'll be pages where they can just doodle and draw. Um, it doesn't even have to be with a spelling lesson. It could just be something, whatever they want to do. And here's another page. And that one says, find 26, 20 words with six letters. And throughout this book, um, you'll also have your child do pages. This one says, circle all the six letter words. And so they're going to, again, interact with the words, finding the six, the words with only six letters. So that's another neat thing in this one. And let's see, this one, here's another page. Search your house, write down 37 letter words. So, and then the last one I wanted to show you is um, Fun Schooling Spelling Journal. This one is not um, part of the word hunt per se, but it does have your child look around the house for words. So this one has um, search your house for 10 six letter words. And then this one says spell five words that could describe this picture. So it's a little bit different than the word hunt, but they're still interacting with the words and looking around the house. 
and towards the end they're going to uh, make their own comics and eventually write a creative writing. So I hope that helps you and I'm really excited about these. Again, you can find these at dyslexiagames.com and Amazon sells them individually. They're about 20 plus dollars. Um, so go ahead and look those up on Amazon or dyslexiagames.com. Thank you for watching and have a great day.